In this tutorial, we will focus on the replay of the Sambalance Lab 2 software. You can easily enter the replay screen by selecting record in the main menu and press the replay button. This is the replay screen of the Sambalance Lab 2 software. The replay screen is divided into four areas. On the top left corner, you can find the view of the force data. Below, you can find the center of pressure values for the body and feet. On the right top corner, you see the video and below, the balance view with the current force distribution and the actual COP position. Every area can be enabled and disabled by pressing the buttons on the left side. So you can easily focus on the information which is the most interesting for you. The size of each area can be adjusted by dragging the bars up and down or from the left to the right. On the bottom of the screen, you can find the control elements of the replay. By pressing the play button, the replay will start in a continuous loop. You can jump and navigate through the replay by pressing the left mouse button on a certain position in the bar. You can also hold the mouse button and navigate in real time through the replay and go to certain positions of your swing. By right clicking into the bar, you can define markers for certain swing positions like swing start, top of backswing, impact and the playback start and end position. The marker positions are very important if you want to compare different swings with each other and for the data display in the report. With defining the playback start and end position, you can get rid of unimportant measurement data and COP movement. This would be the case if your recording is longer than the relevant information of the swing itself. Just define the start and end position and press the trim button to cut out unnecessary information. Beside the trim button, you can also determine the playback speed by adjusting the slider to the speed you want. Now we will start with the first area, the force data view. In this area, the actual force distribution is displayed in 2D or 3D. Depending on the force which is applied to the SAM balance lab, the color bars change the color from blue to red. The white line shows the COP position of the body throughout the swing. On the right side, you can find three buttons. By pressing the upper button, you can switch between 2D and 3D mode of the view. The second button allows you to determine the split position of toe and heel and left and right. After you've pressed the button, click onto the force plate and position the crosshair so the toe, heel and left, right are correctly divided. By pressing the button again, you will confirm the new split position. With the third button, you can fast toggle between different preset views. If you press and hold the left mouse button in the force data view area, you can rotate the view by moving your mouse up and down or from the left to the right. By turning the mouse wheel or pressing the plus and minus keys on your keyboard, you can zoom in and out. While pressing the right mouse button in the view area, you can move the plate. So you can easily adjust to the view you are most interested in. Below the force data view, you can find the area which shows the force curves and timing information of the record. By default, the graph shows the overall force curve for the whole body. The amount of downforce is an indicator how good a player can transfer weight into the direction of the ball. The actual position is shown by the black line. If you have determined the marker positions, for example top of backswing or impact, these lines will also be shown. If you right click into the area, you can adjust the graphs which are displayed like overall force, left force, right force and so on. On the top right corner, you can see the video view area. By clicking on the overlay options, you can easily add drawing symbols to the video like lines, circles and angles. If you click on save overlay button, the current overlays will be saved to this record permanently. On the lower right corner, you can see the balance view area. It shows the balance of the player by providing the current COP position for the body in form of a red dot, the total percentage values of weight on front, back, left and right and the heel-toe balance for both feet separated. The balance view is great to check weight distribution of a player against reference values given for certain positions, for example that you have 80% on your rear foot and 20% on your front foot at the end of backswing. 
Within the replay screen, you are also able to compare swings with each other. Therefore, click on the double view icon on the lower right corner of the screen and choose the swing you want to compare with. Now, both swings can be seen on one screen and you can compare them with each other. If you have set the marker positions, you can easily align the swings to each other to a certain point. Therefore, select the marker you want to align to and press the Align button. We hope that we could give you a good overview about the replay screen. Please check out our additional tutorials for more information about the Sam Balance Lab 2 software. Thank you for your time and all the best from the Science Motion Sports team.